Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your July 2018 general reading. Now it's a general reading so it won't resonate with everyone who views the video so don't try to make it resonate if it doesn't. Um, thank you guys for me reaching 10,000 subscribers. Uh, just for that I'm going to do a special $5 one question reading um, and that'll go it'll come to you via email okay so five dollar one question reading all right take advantage of that go over to the website or shoot me an email and I'll send you a PayPal link that's uh, the fastest way to pay and you know get the process started PayPal and uh, yeah so take advantage of that five dollar one question via email reading uh, because I've reached 10,000 subscribers so um Thank you to all of you. All right, let's get started. Uh, here we have past, present, future, and love. And then we have um, career and finance, and then our additional cards of support. Uh, let's look at the bottom of the deck for career, uh, for love, okay? Eight of Cups. All right. Someone may be choosing to leave a, seat, a situation that looked from the outside in like it was, you know, fully intact. It looked like it was great. But only you know why you're leaving Capricorn. Only only you know why. May, or maybe someone else is doing it to you. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Only you know why or the other person knows why they're choosing to check out either emotionally or you know physically walk away we'll see what the other cards have to say um just emotional instability it's all over the place you know you just couldn't pinpoint what the damn issue was you know um okay somebody's mad because i i just cursed yeah anyway let's keep going past seven of swords Knight of Cups, the Emperor. Someone, okay, so this is a man. In the past, there was either a husband or a husband like figure, a long standing relationship. Someone's very dominant, who has their, you know, has everything together. Um, they might have been cheating, outright cheating. I can't even walk. I was trying to get around it, you know. Might have been cheating, uh, sneaking around, offering their love, their cup of love elsewhere. Uh, dating, you know, the Knight of Cups it talks about dating. They might have just been acting single, but knowing that they're partnered and they're married or or in a long-standing relationship. This could be you, Capricorn. This could be someone you're dealing with. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries here, Taurus. Okay, presently we're at the Knight of Wands, we're at the Eight of Wands, and we're at the Six of Cups. Someone's trying to come back. I don't know if it is a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, but they're coming back. They're coming back with a lot of passion. They want to reignite things. You know, they, they're giving you the messages of love. They're even talking about the trouble that was in the relationship. Um, they feel like either you're a soulmate or we need to stay together for the children. Or I just cannot stop thinking about you. The thoughts of the memories that we have, you know. It's enough to keep me here presently. But keep in mind... Capricorn, if this is someone doing this to you, it could be a fire sign can or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This is the Knight of Wands. This is the Knight of Cups. These, you know, this is very whimsical energy. You know, I'm in, I'm out. I feel this way about you today. I feel another way about you tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow could be next month. You know, not saying tomorrow, but I don't know. It's not very solid. It's not the Knight of Pentacles. It's not the King of Pentacles. It's not the Ace of Pentacles. It's nothing real solid. So, you know, and it might just be the the early part of trying to win somebody back. We'll see. Let's see what the future holds. Okay. <clears throat> future. Justice. Nine of Pentacles. 
The hangman. Even someone might be trying to come back here presently. It's temporary. I think some of you Capricorns see through it. Um, they still, you know, they still have their player ways. They're still in and out. There's still trouble here. But at the same time, it's still, you know, something that binds you two together. But in the future, we have the Justice, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Hangman. Someone is definitely on the brink of um, going down and filing those papers. Those actual divorce papers. They need to find balance within themselves. For themselves. They're completely concerned about the tangible about this the stability of a, of a situation of a relationship the justice and nine of pinnacle some of you capricorns can be dealing with a libra um you're it could be vice versa you're thinking about walking away from a libra or they're thinking about walking away from you they're the hangman status they're waiting for a, do something else do one more thing say something else let them find out one more thing or let them you know they're waiting for enlightenment in, in regards to this situation. There, This is a person on the brink of, you know, just, you know, it's like just the, the straw that breaks the camel's back. It hadn't happened, but it's like right there. All right, bottom of the deck for career and finance for Capricorn is the Ten of Pentacles. Nice. Uh, good fortune, good money, travel. Uh, your fortune is changing also here. Stability in uh, your finances and your home. That might not be an issue for some of you. Or maybe it is a suit of cards. King of Swords. King of Spades, uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Typically, this is Libra and or Aquarius. It could be Gemini. Queen of Pentacles is typically Capricorn. Ace of Spades. Six of Hearts. Three of Hearts. Yeah, it looks just like either some of you are having an ending to a, a long-standing career. You're going to, you know, try to transform how you make money. Um, you try, it's, it's still very new. You're thinking about an ending and a new beginning in the way you make money. It might have some 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 good luck, some, some good Samaritan help comes along, and almost like a mentorship here. You regret saying things or not saying things here, also, um, in regards to maybe this long-standing job. For some of you, it had it, you know it looks like love and romance. It looks like the ending. Um, of this, you know, of this long-standing relationship. Yeah, you feel like they're your soulmate. There might even be children involved here. You just regret saying things. Now you can't take them back. Like I said, someone's on the brink of, you know, on the brink of walking away. It's too much. It's become too much. Let's see what the butterfly oracle cards have for us. Healing from the past. Now this is either for you Capricorn or that's for someone else. Let's keep going. Relationship dynamics. Yeah. Uh, you are stronger than you know. End of an era and get some rest. Like I said, it just, you know, the whole spread has been pretty fluid you know it's and I'm even getting tired like you know, I before I started the reading I had all this energy I was listening to music and doing a reading I'm just feeling like depleted like 
or at least at the brink of depletion it's like something can come in and turn around for me or something can come in and just make me say oh I'm done and I think that's where that's how some of you feel about a situation it's like if it doesn't turn around um, then it just doesn't turn around I'm okay with an ending uh, if it does turn around okay I'm willing to put the work in also I'm willing to see where this could go relationship dynamics are just highlighted it's just you feel differently the other person feels differently it's just 110 percent um different now the dynamics of the relationship have altered have changed um someone's entered the relationship someone's exited someone is like i said emotionally checking out sneaking around the relationship the dynamics have changed it's not as how it was when it first started but know that you're stronger than you know you can get through this you can uh, get yourself out if that is what you're looking to do end of an era may, might be the end of um, this relationship if it doesn't turn around it's like you're one foot out one foot in end of an era you either want this to happen the era of just dealing with so much chaos and drama so that you can come into newness either with said person or someone new um yeah that's how I feel where you are you're just like okay wait, what is it i'm okay with whatever's coming for some of you, you need to get some rest you've been going and going and going your mind is going your emotions are racing get some rest and rest isn't just you know go to sleep and wake up oh and I'm I'm rested like go to the spa um get a massage do whatever it is that is restful and peaceful for you that is relaxing that type of rest meditation get some rest Okay, Capricorn, if this resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Take advantage of the new special $5 one question via email reading just because I'm at 10,000 subscribers now. Take advantage of that. Um, go over to the website, send me an email. I'm going to update the website so you can, you know, you can pay over there. If you do go to the website try to pay through PayPal and not the other form of payment it just have some issues with it how about that um remember Capricorn to stay in prayer I am praying for you pray for me as well let me leave you with a quote um okay this one's good I don't think it's a quote it is no not that one um yeah this one okay God can only do the impossible if it is possible it is for us to do D night okay um, so whatever you deem is God for you know that your God does the impossible it's for you to do the possible so let's not interchange the two if it's possible for you to do do it get out there and do it uh, if it's impossible pray to your god you definitely will see you through all right remember to stay in prayer i'm praying for you as well take care guys